Welcome to this session on configuring your premium promotion app. Now that you've installed Easy Promos Premium to your fan page, it's time to configure your promotion. First, I would like to thank Diverse Entertainment, an event planning company out of New Jersey, for allowing us to use their Facebook page and promotion to produce this video. Log into your Facebook page and locate the Promos tab. Click the tab to enter your promotion. Facebook may prompt you to change from being logged in as your business to being logged in as yourself. If this happens, simply click the Continue As button. On this page, you locate the Manage Your Promotions button and you click that to enter your promotion. This is your promotions management page. There are four easy steps to configuring your promotion. We're on step one, creating your promotion. This is where you define the main characteristics of your promotion. It starts off with adding basic information. When you add your title, remember, what you place here is going to show on the text area of your promotion. Let's quickly glance over at trip dates from a previous video and remind ourselves of what they did. Here it is, the title and description. Nicely spaced, use of bolding, bullets and dashes. So let's go back to our page. Okay, so you can see I've typed in the title and the description and used these common editing tools here where necessary. Now let's scroll down to see what's next. In the countries field, you have three options to choose from. You can select one country by locating the country and clicking on it. You can also select multiple countries by holding down the control key and select additional countries. And lastly, if you want to have all countries eligible, you select just above here in the blank space and now every country can get involved. Please note when selecting states or provinces to include in your promotion and eliminate others, you do this one of two ways. The first is in your terms and conditions you clearly state, for example, entries only valid for the residents of the state of Florida. The second is to target your external marketing efforts such as LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, Facebook ads, Google AdWords to target people by that specific state or province. Now let's look at terms and conditions. Enter your terms and conditions here and we'll cover this in a further video. Promotions and dates. You must complete all of these date fields including the time zone. You can strategically select the time of day or night to begin or end your promotion. Please note the premium app is equipped with a powerful preview tool. In order to access this tool you need to make the publication date the current day. Your promotion will not be live until you physically activate it. All entries including entries we haven't addressed as yet are fully editable later and leading up to your going live date. Let's scroll down and see what's next. Entries configuration. You have some options to do with the entries. We have seen some contests requiring maximum entries, so you can enter the number here if this applies to your promotion. If you check mark this box, your entries will be visible to the public. This is necessary for voting contests. This next section deals with voting configuration. Check the first box if this is a voting contest, otherwise you can bypass this section. Check only fans can vote to enable fan gating. This is a big difference between our basic and premium apps. Enabling fan gating provides the additional benefit of getting more likes and increasing your prospecting base since you will know who the voters are when you activate this option. You can also elect to show all voters publicly or leave them anonymous. For the registry form you have the option to collect this data from your users. Check the boxes that apply to your promotion. Keep in mind less is more in many cases. The fewer hoops that you make your participants jump through the better. So if date of birth and gender for example aren't important, leave them blank. Let's scroll down now and complete the remainder of the form. For contests requiring participant comments, pictures or videos, you use these fields to instruct them what you want them to do. For example, in the comments section you could ask them to include a description about your funniest wedding experience. In pictures it could be something like upload your favorite picture of you and your sweetheart. In videos it could be something like search YouTube and upload your favorite wedding video. I've typed in the first First one so that you can see exactly what it looks like. Now check to accept Easy Promos Terms and Conditions and press Add Promotion. Step 2 is about selecting your template. For your information, the 8x10 template option was introduced in September 2012 and comes with some very nice options. You can see by the thumbnails of each template how your promotion will be displayed. Choose the one that you prefer. For a full description of the benefits of the new template version, stay tuned for a link at the end of this video. Now let's continue to the next step. 
Now we choose the image that we've created or had our graphic designer create for this promotion. Please note, if you have not created a promotion banner at this point, skip this step and go to the advanced configuration. You will get a chance to return through the edit portal to upload your banner. I have a banner and I'm going to select that now. This takes us to the drafts promotion interface. From here you can edit your promotion, delete, preview, activate, view entries, or fetch the link to the promotion. Let's preview the promotion. This is the preview mode. You're seeing an exact preview of the layout of each page of the promotion. This is a simulation only and the user information shown here if any is not real. This completes the configuration of your promotion. It will be important for you to view the next video titled editing of your promotion. Thanks for watching.